Do your job. This video is brought to you by GoDaddy. Enter code HUB749 for domain name discount, HUB20 for 20% off hosting plans, and code HUBFILE for discount off of online file folder plans. Let the bodies hit the floor. 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 I was in Washington not long ago, and the turnout there was brilliant. I met so many fans, and I met so many um, uh, you know, people that wanted me to fight there. Uh, didn't I know... I know Lamont Peterson is from Washington, so he's going to have his own support there. But I really think I won't be much behind him. This is a fight that could have happened before, isn't it? But That's why right. Why did it take so long to, for it to come off? This fight could have happened about six or seven months ago. Uh, the reason it happened was because um, I think Lamont said he needed a little bit more experience. And I mean, even though he's had a lot more fights than me and he's a lot older than me, uh, I don't know why that was. But now he's my mandatory challenger for my IBF title that I hold. And uh, he has to fight me no matter what, unless... Um, they, I get the title stripped off me, so and and it's also a big opportunity for him to fight for a world title. So that's the reason he's taking this fight, and I'm happy he's taking the fight. I'm grateful that this fight's happening, and it's a, it's going to be an exciting fight because you've got two styles there: a box fighter versus a box fighter, uh, and he's quick himself, he's powerful, so it's going to be very exciting. As you collect more and more belts from more and more organisations, is it going to become more difficult to keep them all happy? Yeah, definitely. You know, I, I'm trying my best. I'm just fighting whoever's in front of me. And if they have a title, they have a title. If they don't have a title, then, you know, I'll still fight them and beat them. Um, but, you know, it's one of them things. I mean, you have to keep everyone happy. Uh, but for me, is to fight the best and beat the best. And that's what I'm here for. Now, I know you said you want to move up to 147 after this. But if Timothy Bradley were to come to the table now, would you say yes? Or is he, has he left it too late now? I think he's left it too late. But you know what? I'll con probably consider the fight with him again if he will come over to me because I know I, I know I want to beat him before I move over to 140 and c clearly I know I've been moved to number one in the world but I want to be I want to make sure and prove to even him uh, that I am the number one I mean that fight should have happened a long time ago even that fight's been dragging and I've tried my hardest to get the fight on but he just doesn't seem to want it so your three fights which you're planning for next year you expect they'll all be at 147 do you? Um, yeah yeah I want them all at 147 definitely yeah so 2011 has been a great year 2012 even better even maybe better. let's hope it's even better and pick up another two town two weight world champion uh, let's try that um, and you know it's going to get exciting for me some big names in that 147 division and um, it's, there's a new goal for me and new ambition Mayweather by the end of next year definitely this time next year could be a Mayweather fight that's fantastic great to look forward to it thank yeah. you very much thanks a lot Amir appreciate it